In our other top story tonight, brand new information to a wrong way crash on I-75 that left four people dead. It happened early Sunday morning in the southbound lanes right by 11 Mile in Royal Oak. The crash scene is right as you approach the intersection with I-696. Sean Lay is live on this story, and Sean State Police released an update on this this afternoon. We're talking about four people, Kimberly, in a van simply heading down southbound right here in these lanes. They had no idea coming right at them was deathly, uh, deadly danger. South 75 and East 11 Mile Road. Wrong way driver caused the crash. This is what southbound I-75 looked like as first responders, police and fire were running onto the interstate hoping to make rescues. On the right of your screen, that is a Volkswagen. It is on fire. The driver was dead behind the wheel. That driver has been ID'd by state police as the wrong way driver. Just before 3 Sunday morning, that driver was coming north on 75 in the southbound lanes. Fire personnel responding CPR in progress. Dispatch. Station 1 trucks in route. Station 1 in route. Madison Heights is shutting the freeway down at 12. It appears the driver of the minivan truly had no chance. Three people were killed in that minivan. One who was in the van remains in critical condition. Driving to local four at this same hour, around 3 a.m. over the years, I've encountered three wrong way drivers. We asked local four crime and safety expert Darnell Blackburn if there is anything a driver can do. You also have to be prepared to defensively drive. That means keeping both hands on the steering wheel. And if a vehicle is coming towards you, you can maintain better control by swerving and avoiding a head-on collision. All right, back here live in Royal Oak. I just hung up the phone with the Royal Oak Fire Chief. He says in 36 years of fighting fires here and being a first responder, this is one of the worst things he's ever seen. Much more details coming up live at 6. We're live in Royal Oak tonight. Sean Lay, Local 4. It's awful. Okay, Sean, thank you. And seeing this tragedy unfold, we wanted to do a bit of a deeper dive into wrong way crashes to see if there are any trends. So we dug through some data from Michigan State Police, and here's what we found out. In 2019, 373 wrong way crashes. That number spiked in 2021 at 421. And just last year, the state logged 420.